16. You will need straws, water, dish soap, a cup, and a spray bottle. Let's get started. Okay, so I have my cup. And I have my cup. So step one, pour some water into your cup. Okay, so now step two, add some dish soap into your cup. Okay, great. So step three, take your straw and stir it up. Step four. Now you're gonna grab your water with the soap and add it into your spray bottle. So take your water and you're gonna add it into your spray bottle. We already did that. Okay, so now that you have your cups, Go ahead and set them to the side. And next, what you want to do is spray your area. But before you spray, make sure it's a safe area to spray. You don't want to go crazy spraying it everywhere. So I'm going to spray my area. You want to get it all around, all the dry spots. Make sure to spray all of the dry spots because this will help you blow big bubbles. So now that you have your cups, and now that the table is nice and wet, just take your cups, take your straw, make sure you dip it into the soap, and now set your straw on the wet area and blow a bubble. just seen Terry blow this bubble. So Terry, what do you think will happen if we put a straw through the bubble? We get another bubble. That's, that's what you think? That's what I think. Okay, well let's test it. So let's test it. The question was, what will happen if you place a straw in a bubble? So Terry blew a bubble. Now he's dipping his straw into soap water. Did it pop? Nope, it went straight through. And look, he's blowing another bubble inside. Why did that happen? So the straw went straight through that bubble. So let's see what happens if I try to put my finger through the bubble. Pop, pop. Why didn't it go straight through the bubble? Well, it's because the straw had soap water on it. So that soap water helped the straw move through the bubble without popping it. My finger was very dry. When a bubble is near a dry area, it pops. So that is how we are blowing bubbles on the soap water on the table. I hope you enjoy and please try this at home. Thank you for watching.